guys. Another Misfits order has come today and so we are going to do our Misfits box reveal. So I just wanted to uh, share this with you and again um, Misfits is a great company that actually really helps the, the circulation of food. <laughs> Anyway, um, and reduces food waste. So um, there are many companies out there like that. And um, so I suggest, you know, give it a try. And it's, um, you can't beat these prices for organic food. That is perfectly wonderful. So without any further ado, let's open it up. recipe card oh my god this recipe is for a seasonal peach crisp hmm I don't know if you've seen my other videos about pear crisp um, I wonder why they gave me peach crisp maybe it has something to do with what's inside so anyway apparently it comes with recipes so that's cool and uh, maybe this will be in a future video now I'll try to make it keto so um, it can appeal to all kinds of um, diets. And it has a promotional um, sale promo. <laughs> Not sure why. I guess that's kind of nice. Um, I mean, look at these prices. This is sale price. I wonder if you can see that. Tomatoes. Regularly organic Roma tomatoes. Two thirty-five in the store in some stores I guess um, and here it is 155 so as a savings of 34 percent so um, just an example this is a great company highly recommend it so let's see what else is in here okay again we have Biodegradable packaging. Kind of looks like carpet filling, but um, it's, I guess, cotton batting. I wonder if I could use this in a pillow. Don't know. Anyway, I also have the wonderful bio. What's it called? Oh, it's leaking. Why is it leaking? Bio drain. That is leaking. So oh, these little plastic things are not real sturdy and sometimes they burst so just be aware of that they do keep the food cold and um, this can this is what it looks like I don't know if y'all can see that <laughs> it's leaking everywhere so those that liquid is um, biodegradable and that actually can go down the sink um, just make sure you run the hot water and if you have a septic tank, I wouldn't, I wouldn't do that. Okay, so what do we have? My hand. Ugh. Oh, okay. I can't stand it. Okay. Okay, let's get down to the good stuff. So here we have today, ooh, organic cherries. Look at that. Look at this. Can you imagine? That tastes one. Mmm. Perfectly ripe. Mmm. 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 That is so good. So we have organic cherries. Again, try to buy things organic as much as possible. Oh, we have these organic great tomatoes fun to eat I love them these are really great because all you have to do is cut them in half if you want to like put them in some sort of vegetable dish <laughs> so anyway 
These look really cute. Oh my. Look at that. Isn't that beauty? It's so pretty. Mmm. 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 These tomatoes taste like they were just picked off the vine. That's what a tomato should taste like. If you get a tomato and it doesn't have a strong tomato flavor, it's probably not in season. And, you know, the, the fruit sugars haven't been able to develop on the vine when it grows. And so um, it's not as tasty. A lot of hothouses um, will grow this. But this is really good. All right, we've got something in a clamshell. Fun. Fun, fun, fun. Oh. Mm. We got black plums. So cute. I can't wait to eat those. I love plums. I love all fruit, except for one. There's one fruit that I can't eat. Has anyone, have you ever heard of durian? I'm not sure why this is on earth, to be honest. Some, oh, you know, some people like it. You can have it. I will give you my portion. What are these? Oh, oh, you know what? These are not black plums. These are red plums. Now, oh, that's a black plum. Very good. Hmm, what can I do with plums? It's my creative juices thinking. Thinking. Oh, <laughs> I've never had these. They look like little flying saucers. These are peaches. Um, these are donut peaches. So cute. So, oh, maybe that's why the peach Rest, peach crisp recipe was in there so we could have peaches. And we got some more peaches. Awesome. I like the box that it comes in. I like all kinds of boxes. We got some more kale. Actually, this is like old school kale. <laughs> that newfangled stuff. Um, so, good old USA kale. Nice and hearty. One trick to cooking with kale you want to squish it before you chop it up or after you chop it up before you cook it you want to kind of massage it and break some of that cellulose down it cooks a little bit easier and it's a little easier to digest kind of doing some of the work so and then we have yay more blueberries love me some blueberries all kinds of stuff in here what is this Ooh. Green beans, lovely. Oh, fresh green beans, mm, so good. All right, we got some broccoli. Got nice, nice fixings for broth. All that right there. It smells good too. All right. That's a sweet potato. I think. I don't know. It's kind of purple. Not sure what these are. They're wet though. They need to be washed. They got the bioprene all over it. Oh, sitting in it. Some avocado. That's what I'm saying. Nice size avocados. Think more sweet potatoes. Lovely. We got the mango. We got the mango. Love the mango. Love, love, love mango. Okay, what else? <gasps> My favorite. Brussels sprouts. That's a segment. Definitely gonna do another video on that. Good lord, look at this corn. My god. These things are huge. <laughs> look at this. Crazy. That's all we have. So, anyway, 
thank you my sister for helping me um, with this subscription um, for our birthday and um, again take care of yourself and take care of each other and be well take care bye bye